Holly from Moscow, I hope. Um, when I was young, we could look at our politicians with respect. They were people we could respect. We knew that they, for the most part, were, as far as we knew, looking out for us. Appearance of impropriety, they tried to avoid appearance of impropriety. It could be a death sentence for somebody's career. And we've seen the Republican Party, and there are corporate Democrats here in Hawaii either, so, but they were taken over by such an extreme bunch, the Tea Party. They're not even really the Republican Party anymore. We're not looking at people who had the values of the, the old Republican Party anymore. <clears throat> and to the extent that they don't even try to hide their corruption, it's shocking to me that they wear it like a badge of honor. Well, yeah, I'm corrupt, deal with it. <laughs> and and we're supposed to we're supposed to accept it and we're supposed to sit back. And the problem has been that we have not, we've been complacent, we've not been out there voting, we haven't voted at the local levels, we haven't been involved, we've been sitting in front of our television sets, our internets, whatever. On voting day, people have to vote. If you care about something, you have to vote. And I don't think the majority of Americans agree with what is going on now. They're taking away all the good that has been done in just, in no time. And it's just shocking to see that in this short period of time, this group of people are doing so much damage to the rest of us. Um, it's horrifying. I was kind of glad my parents are to to see it because they would be very, very ashamed of our country. Thank you. We're going to do some consensus statements.